Ah. You're still talking to me, then? Oh, I wouldn't blame you for giving me a wide berth. I thought the orb's ever-present censure had tamed my wilder ambition, but that wasn't the case. I needed Mistra's intervention. She offered me a path to redemption at last, and it might yet leave my mind and body intact. Please, continue to believe in me. I want to show you the wizard I am capable of being, rather than the poor excuse for a man who's kept your company thus far. You stole the words from my mouth. I know what I must do. The crown belongs under Mistress stewardship, not mine. And I will ensure she gets it. That means there'll be no permanent place in the heavens for us. <laughs> but we can still visit. Please, close your eyes a moment. Astra Navigamus. Few mortals ever glimpse what you're about to see. But don't be alarmed. I'm here with you. Now, open your eyes. Quite the view, isn't it? The Outer Plains are a place of profound, sometimes overwhelming possibility. I conjured this illusion often during my confinement in Waterdeep. An escape for the mind, where there was none for the body. It was easier to stare at the celestial abyss than recognize the emptiness within myself. Easier to pretend my destiny lay among such stars than work to salvage a life on solid ground. You changed all that. You see me as I am, and do not find me wanting. With these stars as my witness, I swear, you will always be enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> 